All right, now we're gonna go from Aquinas, whoop de doo, to the Westby Norseman, one of the neighboring school districts for where our the command center currently is. Westby is getting ready to contend with the Cooley Conference's best this year. That's going to be a hard conference to win because West Salem's coming back for year two. Aquinas. There's year one and two that you, the two headed monsters you gotta get past. Two of them went to state. For two totally different divisions, which is really confusing when it comes to the Cooley Conference because. How do you have a Division 4 and 5 team in the same conference? And then some Division 6 teams thrown in there too? It's, it's a weird conference. But anyways, the Westby Norsemen will have a Baker's Dozens worth of seniors coming back and just as many of their starters returning. Westby finished last year 6-4 with a one win improvement from the year before. Westby's coach Andy Hulse and his team, they're getting ready for their game week one game at Richland Center. And getting some early wins will help boost their spirits for what's next. Realistically, a win will always boost your spirits. The more winning you do, the higher spirits. The less winnings you do, the lower spirits. Believe me, I've experienced it. But, uh, yep, this coach was thinking the same thing I am. Realistically, I think that we should be competing with some of these teams for our conference. West Salem, Aquinas, GET, Arcadia will be better. It's a very tough conference. Yeah. It's a very tough conference that's all over the map. But, it's still there. Obviously, we've seen that get over the last couple of years. The Aquinas winning state twice and the last two years of West Salem getting two state. It's hard to get on that level. That's what we're hoping to get this year. Yeah, you get there. I'll be covering. Because you'd be a local team that made it. Hulse also added the conditions for practice have been hot and dry. But he's still proud of his guys' work ethic since the start of camp. Yeah, who's gonna tell him that Friday night, the Friday night lights are gonna be a scorcher. It's supposed to be in like the 90s. That's gonna be a scorcher. But, yeah. I guess the weather is heating up just like the intensity for football season. 